tent is off. So we are back at Murio Arians. Brennan has told me the refit is finished, so we're gonna go check out all the fantastic things that have happened. So we are back on board. Am I, is this a good time, Brennan? Just put out some crew food so the galley's not perfect, but hey, this, hey. Is, this is a fact of life. Yes, it is. We have sunshine. Oh! The covers are off. Your boat has been undressed. Still out of the water, you can still about yep. four stories down. That That is ground. That is hard, They call, hard it, they call it being on the hard. Oh yeah, it's called being on the hard. Yeah. Right now, how was the galley refit? Oh, very good. It's about 95% done. It's awesome. Okay. Uh, let's see, where should we start? Look at this! Okay, let's start here. Hit me. Ah! <laughs> that is super jazzy. Do the heat lamps. <laughs> that is power. That is power. Guys, I'm getting a suntan here. Ooh. So, it's so good. It's it's amazing. Luckily, we could get something custom made. So we got this made. And Did you say it's custom? Custom. Only Brennan Dates would get custom heat maps. <laughs> we got lucky. We got lucky. There was money in the budget. We can watch it in action. Boom. So Lights. there's no heat. No heat. Zero heat. And then three sections. One there, middle, and oh all my God. graduated to whatever you need. Seems like a little weird that we're geeking out over heat lamps, but as a chef, it is just so important because you get to keep your food at the right temperature when it gets sent out to the guests. I think one of the most discouraging things as a chef coming from land and good in the ass is to realize the food has to go like three decks yes. into the wind. So at least this gives us a little more time to yeah. preserve its temperature. All right, what else is new? This is this, controversial. This is new. This is, con this this is, controversial. is controversial, guys. Yep. This doesn't quite fit. A gastro tray, so they're redoing it free of free of charge. So they're gonna make it much more low profile, much more delicate, because basically this could hold like a high powered microwave, and that's not quite what we need it for. But we're gonna make this like way more delicate, yeah. cut away, slimmer, it'll be better. But down here, there was a much smaller bain marie this it was, way. It was way more shallow. This one is customizable. So you want one in there, you want two separate ones right now, Sweet. I have oil and vinegar. Yeah, cooking is doable. But it's too hard. But I can't actually like see what's there. So this is definitely a Brennan galley, not a Nina galley. Yeah, but you could just move it down there. I would move it down here and not have my vinegar up here. Yep. Sweet cherry. Yum. <laughs> glug glug. Okay. So we've got the controversial shelf, and then what? So these are hot plates. Obviously, I've used them today. A company called Ego. So Ego and MKN are the top. The what top. about Verna? Mm, as far as induction, I don't know. A lot of people make induction. Roland are trying to make their own induction. Roland should stay in their lane. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, these these are great. They're very powerful. And each one has a separate generator. Before we had a four banger here, which was bad, because then if you lost one, you kind of had to replace the whole thing. So we okay. did separate units. And I think the generators are five kilowatt. It's still Ooh. hot, I just used it. New grill, new grill. This is awesome. Cool. This is 150 euros. <laughs> Wait. That's a piece of plastic. 150 euros, is what I was told. <laughs> what does it do? It's really quite important because it, it keeps all the water when you're cleaning on uh, it. Oh, yeah, yeah. And it's heat resistant, so you can have it in all the time. Mm, it doesn't okay. melt. Fryers? Um, so new fryers, these are custom. Uh, Renee has custom done these baskets. So at first, they feel like a little cumbersome. They get dirty quick, but your fryer oil doesn't get dirty. And if you want to fry some rice, if you want to fry some quinoa, like it stays in the basket. They're like silpat mats. Yeah, they, they, they look like they're not porous, but I promise, here, dunk one. Okay, yeah, that's that's porous. Amazing! So, basically, you would have seen in Brennan's video, all this got ripped out. These are all, like, schmancy and nice. There was some, like, very, very, very good welding going on. If you didn't watch the video, make sure yeah. you go and check it out. Yeah, that was some good workmanship. The next step. This is what's not quite finished. Just insert some footage of the final <gasps> product now. <laughs> Alright, so this is the final kind of part of the refit. Yeah, you know, come out of the oven, boom. Or vice versa, go into the oven, right into there. Uh, for now, the juice is getting stored down there. That might change. We have our little smoker, like uh, adapter thingy there, which we love. Uh, lighter prep, thermal, the new mixer. We gotta name this, Julio. I don't know what we're gonna name it, but this is, this is good stuff here. And, we can make massive amounts of bread, and not two loaves at a time. Yeah, we can probably do eight loaves in this thing. Yes. We went from a seven liter bowl to a 12 liter bowl. Yeah. 12 liters of justice. Yeah. 
gonna be sick. Boom. One more thing. Oh, wait. Maybe the most important thing. <laughs> Dishwasher. The heart and soul of every galley. <gasps> ah. A Hobart. FXL. Just want to say that's the same dishwasher that I have on the boat I'm currently working on, and it is like fantastic. You can fit 600. You can fit <gasps> crates in here. This is what's really important because we store all our food, freezer stuff downstairs in crates in the dry crate. store. So they're a pain to wash, but if you have a dishwasher that fits them, you just chuck them in the dishwasher. How good is that? Let's measure this. I think this one's 525. So it can take 600, I believe. You just casually keep a tape measure around. Yeah, I yeah. do. 525. Yeah. 525. All right. For nice those time. in America, figure it out. Metric system, please. Get with it. <laughs> Calling out my countrymen. <laughs> folk. All right. Any Americans watching this, how do you feel? <laughs> yeah, put in the comments below. <laughs> like like that. that. And because of the cutaway. <gasps> it now, slips, slips on right in. The reason this is important is sanitation. Like to have to hand clean yes. all the- Yes, yes, of yes. Of course, it, it kind of works, but it, it takes more time and it's not quite sanitized. There's so many grooves and weird things for shit to keep. And you're also not gonna wash with like 85 degree water with your hands. It's just too hot, so. Yeah. yeah. Boom. This bad boy. Boo! You're getting way too excited there, dude. <laughs> Massive okay, upgrade. So when's your wedding with the, and what do you want as a wedding present for you and the Hobart? And you and the Hobart? Okay, do you need to start doing Should that? I? <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> Help. <laughs> You've got a brand new galley. Yeah. Well, this much of hot, it. Hotline, yeah. Can you cook us some food? Yeah, let's do it. It's almost seven o'clock and I'm hungry. <laughs> Let's feed the Nina. Feed me! <laughs> What's fantastic about this galley is that the plate cupboard is right here! One of the plate cupboards. Okay, oh, sorry, one of the plate cupboards. Yeah. These are beautiful, I love these. Yeah, they have a nice gold rim. Kind of a bit. Look at that! Grab that one, I think that one's gonna be That's better. beautiful. These are gorgeous. So every single one is different along the edges. It's really beautiful. <laughs> Having nice crockery just gives you a head start on a dish looking good. What is the worst crockery that you've ever plated on? Hold on, I'm just gonna warm up this bowl. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Hermes. What? Yeah. Ouch. I think, I think they put out some trash. The red and the red and white ones. With uh, the, the I didn't see those. I heard about those. They're legendary on this boat. They, they were very bad. Yeah. Uh, this, the one I'm talking about, has some sort of uh, panther on it. Yeah, I've also seen a panther one. Yeah. yeah he's coming. He's coming. He's walking. Yeah. Outside. So when you plate food. Probably the last thing you'd want is some sort of animal on your plate. It doesn't really, it does nothing for the food. No, it does nothing. There's a lot of bad crockery out there. Yeah. It's like shrimp pepperoni. It's awesome, yeah, it is. Look at that, it's like curling up on the edges. Put something in it. How could our pea shoot? I'm gonna fry here. Where should I put? Oh! Oh, look at that! That's a lot of everything. That is so good. No, that was blind luck. Oh, oh, okay, okay, right. He's American, so he has to do deep fried stuff. I feel like a splash of box wine with your skin on. There's a touch. There's a touch. Super play. I want eye contact. Yeah. Okay, that's that's cool. Thanks. You can have that. Get the shit out of it. I 
Put it in two. Yeah, come. No. Get some of your food. <laughs> Don't let me. <laughs> Aren't I lucky, guys? Hmm? Come in, barge my way into my friend's galley, make him cook for me. <laughs> well, thank you, Brennan. No problem. You're the best. I'm eating as well. Thank you so much. You're amazing. Let me put my jaw bowl down. Thank yeah. you, Brennan. Thank you. <laughs> You're thank welcome. You. <laughs> You're welcome. Thanks for coming on. Yeah, this is kind of fun. A whole little start, middle, finish. And yeah. If you miss the the kind of the, the nitty gritty, the, the guts of the white part of the Oreo, <laughs> go to my channel. The middle section of this guts. whole galley refit is um, Brennan's channel. He also has a YouTube channel where, oh my God, he talks about everything. Like kitchen stuff, knife uh, skills. How to dice an onion, how to use a mandolin properly, he also does chef podcasts, and he also does some really crazy adventures as well on his motorbike, so... Yeah, duck down. I don't know, oh come on. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go, we've had it all. We've had galley refit, Brennan's cooked dinner for me, it was bloody amazing. If you want to see more galley stuff, make sure you hit subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Oh, and thanks Brennan, thank you! Bye! Bye! Bye. <laughs>